hello and welcome to this video one secret that makes your online course super 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 duper impactful one of the things that if you know if you see if you kind of closely know is any business any business that you start any business that you intend to start or you're actually working on it or whatever that is it has to become super impactful meaning it has to make that impact it has to be profitable it has to be scaling it has to grow it has to diversify you should be making money with it you should be scaling your business with it a business is not just made just like that and when when we talk about business business is a business business needs to be treated as business business needs business requires efforts and time and investments and resources from your end always think about whenever you're this is not just a course you're building this is not just a community that you're building but this is a business that you work on this is a business that i'm teaching you because i think it took me a lot of time to understand okay this is a business business has got a lot of characteristics business has got a lot of business has got a language with it business has got a specific mindset we need to operate with it it's not like you work today you don't work tomorrow you then work today you didn't work tomorrow it's not like that it's like a business and one of the things one of the secrets that makes your business slash your online course very super duper very impactful is number one and only who are not only it's one it's just you it's just one thing it's not just one thing it's one of the main essential things now what is that one secret is who are you talking to thank you so much for joining in this one video we're going to talk about there nothing damn i've got no no sense scripts to talk about in this one video just want to share it, share it in as a conversation why is it important for you to know who you are talking to it can be a small video it can be a long video let's see how things go no point number one and the only point that i've mentioned over here is who are you talking to you should know exactly who the person you're talking to is now when i say talking to who you're creating that course for who you are creating that content for who are you writing those mails to who are you creating that funnels for who are you creating designing designing your webinars for who are you getting those results for the value that you're giving out who is it for you need to know exactly what the person is now this was one of the common mistakes not the common mistakes one of the challenges that i faced when i first started off is one thing that is for sure 100% for sure even you will come across this one thought is like my product is for everyone oh yes your product is for everyone this brush pen is for everyone this red pen is for everyone this pencil holder is for everyone this air condition is for everyone if you think about it this mouse is for everyone if you think about it every product is for everyone if you think about it if you actually think about it the books are for people the shelf is for people the white box is for people the plant the importance of plants having it in an office in in, in a room is so important you will need to have having the shelves is important having a light color paint is important if you think about it your product whatever you're selling if you actually think about it it can benefit every person on this planet but are we going to do that are we capable of doing it yes we are capable of doing it but are we doing it no we are not doing it now when i say the academy of artists and scientists now if you see in this one academy we teach we learn about business we learn about marketing sales mindset productivity money business strategies frameworks we talk about so many things now do you think if i do this the same thing for manufacturing business will it be helpful yes if i do it for an e-commerce business will it be yes if i do it for schools and colleges and plumbing shops and electricity shops if i do it for everyone is it going to help all of them yes it is going to help all of them but then who am i talking to just just a conversation with an introvert who wants to build business from scratch now when i say when i talk to when i when i say okay someone who wants to build a business from scratch now am i helping on everyone who is helping who wants to build a business from scratch no i'm not doing that i cannot coach a teenager who wants to start a business you know why because the set of mindset is different they don't have much experience i don't know how can i teach them because you no know, for the age category that i tap into has got experience with them has got knowledge with them has got uh, good and bad both experience with them they have a dream that dream went, it, it was like a thing that they the life took pace so fast in their own lives and they forgot about that 
and how can i bring that experience that passion of this that dream of them and conceptualize it a bit and help them build a business on hola ho for example on on shuffle dance for example on come writing on on calligraphy for example on on creating creating content creating courses on mixed martial arts for example creating content on swimming for example creating content on on interior designing on guitar and kind of, no this doesn't go this vocabulary this this what i do is for everyone out there but if you see it's not for everyone again i cannot help i cannot be helping people who are in team in teams because they don't have much experience and i don't know how can i tap into the potential i don't know that i've got i've got no super there are other people who've got a super power in that uh, there there are other people who who understands them more than me so when you see your know, product is for everyone yet for not everyone just for specific category if you want to help people learn maths for example if you create a mathematics Now think about that we want to teach maths all the way from first grade to post graduation in PhDs. Yes or no? Can you do that? Yes, you can do that. But do you want to pick school kids, school kids, or college kids? Now, if you see, if you pick school kids, okay. In school kids, which category, which class do you want to pick? Okay, tenth grade. Okay. Now tenth grade comes with a different mindset. Now they have got board exams. They have got challenges with their relationships. They have got challenges with their own families. they have got challenges with themselves so they are not very much tuned to learn maths and maths is like a monster for them and they've got like great goals to achieve they have great results to achieve but then they are not able to do so algebra trigonometry they are not they want to get great marks at it but then they have no proper guidance so when when, when you narrow it down to those challenges to that one class of students for example 10th grade this is it those challenges are not similar are not same not similar and same challenges with the fifth grade math students now they are younger to them they don't have board exams to worry about they don't have challenges with relationships they don't have they, their life is very calm so for you to teach them you need to have a different mindset now they have difficulty in learning mathematics yes they are experiencing math for the first time for example they don't know what what division is for example they don't know what board mass is for example now the vocabulary is different the tone is different the example that you're going to use is going to be different so this is why when when we when we let's take an example of workouts do you want to people do you want to train people who are in from the age of 10 to 15 or 15 to 20 20 to 25 25 to 30 30 to 35 or say do you want to do you want to train people who are in teens who not in teens, who are who are gender based like either you want to take people who train people who are males or females or do you want to train people who are into finance who are into employment or who are who, are, who is an employer or who is into a business owner or who doesn't do anything but has got like great amount of wealth when you see everyone comes with a different background everyone comes with a different mindset now who runs a business doesn't have much time but who is into corporate life might have a lot of time in their hand because uh, only when they think or okay, they want to work out lose weight or gain weight gain muscle whatever that is or just they're so tired with their own work they just want to spend this one hour working out just to relax themselves different workout all together different mindset all together different energy all together if you think it the one secret that is going to make your business so very impactful your course is so very impactful is when you know who are you talking to when you know who you are you talking talking to you have a conversation with that one friend of yours treat your members like a friend okay the best of your knowledge you are creating courses around that content on on on, on that secrets like who is that one top okay i'm talk, i'm teaching and i'm talking to fazil who is a, definitely a guy who is turning is going to turn 27 who is who lives in chennai who was born in rockin saudi who doesn't understand tamil who understands slightly tamil who is fluent with two languages urdu hindi and english Who knows slightly Arabic, not that great Arabic, but then huh, I know Arabic. So when you when you characterize all these things, when you when it's like okay, what state, what fin, what is for this financial position? What is what what is financial for what for this health goals in the being? What is damage all that? So when you when you put it in a nutshell, and then you think about okay, if if I want to sell Fazil this one brush pen, and Fazil is into entrepreneurship. and how can brush pen work like a therapy for fuzzle so that fuzzle can keep fuzzle's stress levels calm how can i how can fuzzle keep 
for this mood come just by unleashing the creativity stuff like that i'm just giving an example so what when you when you think about it and when you actually start working on it in on this one secret see the impact that you're going to have in your own business in your own course and how impactful is going to be that brings us to the conclusion of this one video we have crossed 10 minutes i had not expected i was just thinking like 4 to 6 minutes would be this video but then again i feel this is a very important topic because when i started off my journey i was okay i'll give this for everyone but then it's not for everyone it's just for that one person that i want to talk to and thank you so much for being a part of this one video slash topic slash podcast and making this video slash podcast me the topic a part of your day hope this has helped you share your comments in the comment section share your learnings in the comment section i am going to see you in an another cool exciting video very soon thanks so much see you on the see you soon